Alrighty, Sky Slippers, let's go ahead and get started with this document bundle. With a document bundle, you can gather a list of documents and then create a link for those documents to send so that someone else can view the documents online. So here I am in my listing file. I'm going to go ahead and go into the Documents tab. On the Documents tab, I can go ahead and select the documents that I want to include in that bundle by checking the box to the left of the document name. Once I selected all the documents, I'm going to go up to the top and click on the Share Docs button. From here, we'll be able to name our document bundle as it appears for the viewer. So I'm just going to go ahead and do Sign Listing Docs, and once you've typed it, go ahead and click on Create. So here we go. We have our bundle link that is shareable. Right here, we've got a message that says, Anyone with the link is granted access to your contact information and the documents included in this bundle. So to easily copy the link, go ahead and click on Copy Link. Now we can just click on the email button and compose an email to whoever we want to send this bundle to. Go ahead and edit the subject line here just to be extra clear. Go ahead and click on this link to view your documents and I'm going to paste the link. All we have to do now is click on send. And off it goes. Just as easy as that. Now anybody that receives the email can just go ahead and click on that link to view the documents. To look at any document bundles you've already sent, you can click on the Shared Bundles tab and you'll see a list of any of the bundles you sent for that property file. On the right side of the page, you can click to deactivate any links that have been sent out for this bundle or click on Copy Again to copy it to your clipboard. If you've got any questions at all, don't hesitate to reach out to the support team. We are here 24-7 to answer any of your questions. Happy sky sloping!